see if uh, see if Danielle. here. Thank you for coming this morning. I have no idea what's going to happen. <laughs> <You better Maybe. laughs> we're we're going to find out here pretty quick. The drill is, uh, once we're done with the briefing and talk about the safety a little bit, uh, we'll get strapped in. You're going to man the radio and we will meet on 12275. We will pre-oil the motor and that's going to take a few minutes. You'll hear one hum and then we will uh, I'll call for clear and then I'm going to run it through with the pre oil motor on 16 blades, four complete revolutions. Stop at that point, it'll be boost pump on, close the canopy, and uh, magnetos on, and we're going to try to start the motor just, just about as quick as that. The, I would like that, that big propeller is completely unforgiving. Uh, who's going to man the APU? You're going to man the APU. So the signal for you, the APU, once the engine's running, is just like it always was. You're going to always approach the airplane from the rear, and that uh, start cart needs to stay out of the propeller wash arc, and you're going to take the cart away this way and get it away from the airplane. We want to stay... There is a note, there is a note in the Dash 1 that says, Caution, don't leave the throttle open after shutdown because the prop manifold regulator could sludge itself up and you could have a runaway throttle on engine start. I, I don't know if that ever happened to you guys in the Sky Raider, but... We never uh, left the throttle open. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, the whole thing is new, so let's try to stay behind the uh, uh, wing line. I know the photographers like to get pretty pictures, but um, which ways would it go? It would go left. To do what? To do yeah, it, it would go this way. So yeah. if you got to stand to take a picture be on this side of the airplane. But we want to uh, be real respectful of the uh, propeller and uh, you want to stay away from the airplane so that it can't hurt you regardless of what happens and, and that's back behind the wing line. So we'll get it started and it's going to smoke hopefully and make a lot of noise and uh, blow a lot of oil and it'll run for five minutes at 1200 RPM and that's the first step in the, uh, in the running schedule. Okay? Do you sure. want to pull it through first? Have you done that? Huh? 16 bytes? All the, the book doesn't it. allow you to do that, and uh, the lower plugs were out. I stuck them for oil, and they're back in. Okay. okay. If, it kick, if it kicks back at all with the engine starter, there's a clutch in there that should prevent it. Yeah, two things. Tail wheel lock. Uh-huh. Throttle idle cut off. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, and when, let's get up on the wing and somebody get in the cockpit and run the controls, and I'll look at the... the uh, carburetor to make sure, one last check, that they really are. Okay. Throttle idle, idle cut off uh, uh, for start. Okay, you can start on the prime, throttle open, sure three quarters of an inch. Uh-huh. That's right, a mixture sure. idle cut off, now throttle three quarters of an inch open. Okay, 16 blades and then you do your, your thing. And, uh, uh, why don't you try a book start? Uh, just jump on. The, we, we used to go like that. Once it's running, once it starts to pop, get on your uh, get on your prime, all the way, and then you adjust your smoke with the throttle. If it's real white smoke, you can you can lean it out a little bit. The problem is if you're too far forward, it'll backfire. And uh, they told us it'll blow the the stacks off. That never happened. So don't be concerned. Okay. Um, and, and then once it's running smoothly, okay, you go mixture, full rich. When, when the RPM starts to come off, get off the prime then, okay? Okay. And you're going to be on the radio 2275. I'll be right. Let me know. Uh, Bo is in left. charge of the fire detail. You get those fire bottles where you want them and get somebody else to help you and brief them. Okay. Bo, well, yeah. I have, I bought the old tanker truck. I think it's time. Small. We're out of excuses. <laughs> So, it's been a long time, I mean, it's been 10 years. 
since uh, we started this project in 13 years since it last ran. Uh, and a lot of people have helped and worked, and I want to thank that lovely lady over there, Judy, for putting oh, yeah. up with my crap. Thank you for putting up with Bob's crap for longer than that. And uh, my brother and my dad, uh, especially, for making all this possible. It's normal. The thing is, the pilot is unassing the airplane, and we still have fire, now we have a problem. Up until that point, we don't. Let it go.
<laughs> That's it, ladies and gentlemen. This <laughs> your show's over, huh? Well, the mags on. If it pumps, jump, jump on the prime. But look, just, just bump the prime. Just get it going, and then bump the prime like that. Look at that. I thought it was coming from here, but uh, I think it got blown. Did it blow up from the bottom? I think it got blown up from the bottom. Like it's I think coming it's, out of one of these joints right that's here. That's what I think. Yeah. It was not enough air, so I added more air, and you saw it started, and then I got it running smooth on the primer, and then brought the mixture up, and when I got off the primer, it quit. Of the day's canceled, we're going drinking. That's <laughs> <laughs> good enough. That's <laughs> good enough to go drinking. <laughs> I think I can get it from above. Maybe they were never tightened Well, up. I never smoked them. Who wants to volunteer to stand Me. and look to see where it's leaking from? <laughs> okay, get, get, ready, get ready with the hose.
Congratulations. Hey, you made it. Worked, guy. It actually yeah. worked. It worked. Can you believe that? I know it. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> I got it running. I got it running, and I'm dead on the primer. And I adjusted the throttle RPM piping. How long, how long did you? Not long. Five seconds. And then I brought the mixture up. And quit. No. As soon as I got off the primer, I quit. Boom. <laughs> That was the first time we started. The second time I started with the with the mixture already enriched. I just 
doesn't work fine. Yeah, and the reason it sounded so fat is because I was uh, warming it up at Rich. Rich. As soon as you told me to bring it, uh, to lean it out some, it, 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 you heard the tone change, it got much better.